So it looks like Tanazaki will be beginning this match on the apron with his tag team partner Martin Kirby starting the match. Kirby uh, has competed for Attack Pro Wrestling many, many times before. Uh, but until yesterday evening in Cheltenham, it had been quite some months before his last appearance. So it's great to have him back here at Kate's. Uh, Tanazaki and Martin Kirby, to my knowledge, although they've never tagged before, they are actually very good friends. Uh, in fact, Martin Kirby has been uh, helping Tanazaki to arrange his stay over here in the United Kingdom and to ensure that he will be appearing in as many places as possible. Uh, so it's, it's fantastic that we've been able to put the two of them on the same team this evening against one of the UK's premier tag teams. I'm excited, Mark. And I believe this is the first time Tanazaki's been uh, in Cardiff for, well, a bit wrestled in Cardiff. This is 16 years he's had in the wrestling industry. Trained by Ultimo Dragon, uh, you know, famous for his work in Dragon Gate. He's a really a worldwide star, is Tanazaki, as he showed last night against Mike Bird, and as he will show tonight up against CCK. Well, Tanazaki picked up on his Attack Pro Wrestling debut last night, a victory against the Ginger Jesus Mike Bird. Uh, in a, a very impressive who, match. Yeah, a, a man who once upon a time, you know, he, he competed Mike Bird in the first ever Attack Pro Wrestling Championship match, so absolutely no slouch. Tanazaki showing his credentials already. Kirby's credentials well known to people who have been watching Attack for quite some time. Uh, one of the winners of the first ever Chris Travis Tag Team Invitational Tournament, for example. And here we see Chris Brooks and Kirby trading leg sweeps. Really stepping toe to toe and a big face off. No man can get the better of the other. I believe this entire match will be incredibly close call between the two teams. Yeah, I'm not sure how to call this. I mean, could it be a factor that Lycos has been out for so long, Mark? I mean, I mean Ring Rust is always something to consider after an injury. could be making the tag to Tanazaki as we see him face off with Chris Brooks. The crowd want Lycos to step in against Tanazaki. And what a way to get back in the ring. And what Lycos' first opponent back from long-term injury oh, could well he? be. He does it. He's going to face off against Noiki Tanazaki. Kid Lycos being a student of Japanese wrestling for a long time studying it throughout his entire career, throughout his training. A big fan of Japanese wrestling. Well, a well-educated wrestler is Kid Lycos. I'm sure he's a fan of Tanazaki's work. Tucking his clothesline. You're right, Lycos. Brain buster! Go for the brain buster oh, straight away! Oh, but Tanazaki oh. reverses! Big, big jawbreaker there to Tanazaki. Tries to give him the Irish whip, but switched. Big by house plus there, and it catches him with a big forearm. Leg Larry from Lycos, and oh, oh. bring it back to his feet, hasn't missed a beat. It's like he's never been gone, Mark. Lycos is back, and you're right, he will have seen Tanazaki's work over and over again. Lycos, a massive, hugely inspired by Dragon Gate, uh, amongst other Japanese wrestling promotions, where Tanazaki spent so, so long. And Tanazaki now. Oh, a big leg Russian leg sweep. <laughs> giving him a nice little pose back as well. And of course, and now mocking Lycos. Lycos, incredibly popular, particularly this evening upon his return. But Tanazaki has really endeared himself to the UK fanbase already. Only a Definitely. few days here into his into his UK trip. Uh, we're very lucky to have him over with us here at Attack Pro Wrestling. Big drop kick there from Kirby. Followed up to that big double back elbow. Tanazaki and Kirby working very well as a team here. Uh, absolutely, as I say, even though, to my knowledge at least, they've never teamed before, one thing that they, they, they do know each other very, very well. They are good friends. They are sure will be able to communicate with one another very, very well and work in tandem with each other very, very well in spite of whatever language barrier there, there may be. Uh, Kirby, of course, incredibly experienced as well. Tag there from Chris Brooks. Oh, and head scissors on the ropes. Big knee from Brooks. Big flip sent on from Lycos. Pulls him off the ropes. Oh, an assisted kick to the back with a backdrop position. And only a two there as Kirby kicks out. 
Of course, Martin Kirby, as well as being an esteemed tag team wrestler, uh, is also highly accomplished as a tag team wrestler. As I mentioned earlier, along with his tag team partner, El Liguero, won the first ever Chris Travis Tag Team Invitational in this very room, Mark Andrews, last year. And before that, having many years tagging with Chris Travis himself as Project Ego, one of the best teams in Europe. Like us now taking control over Kirby. And how great is it to see that he hasn't missed a beat at all. Now he hangs him up in the rope, got him in the tree of woe position. What's he going for here? He's got a new move, Mark. He's got a new move. He's had plenty of time to be sat dreaming up new moves, and that's what we might be able to see well now. Like us home run he's going for here. Knocking it out of the park. He's going to every corner of the <laughs> ring. Mocking Tanazaki oh! as always. Big drop kick to Kirby. Scuba face. dives Tanazaki, drops the kick on Kirby. Oh, Big kick Kirby out. gets the shoulder up. Of helpless in that tree of woe position as Lycos performed a lap of honour. Now working on the on the torso of Martin Kirby here. Snap map from Chris Brooks. Oh, big knee to the face there. Of course, Lycos so rarely the more vocal of the CCK pairing. Chris Brooks, we hear from much more when Lycos does try and speak up. He is rather promptly told to shut up, Lycos. Yes. Uh, but, but you think he's missed him, you know? He's well, probably they, missed him in his time out. They have still spent a lot of time together. Lycos has still appeared at ringside for many of Chris Brooks' appearances over the course of his injury. Uh, there to support his longtime friend and tag team partner. But, oh. And Chris Brooks now marking down Azaki. And that's a family that show here, language, Brooks. I think, Mark. means the same in any language. A lot of trash talk between the two teams. Oh, and stepping on the hand of Kirby. What's he going for here? It's been a long time since he's, he's been able to try and hit these brain busters. I think we know exactly what he's going for here. And of course, one, two. Kirby holds up the win there. Lycos nearly in Paris on his return there. Too much time showboating, perhaps. He's got to hit it this time, definitely got to hit it this time. Oh no, a knee to the face. Could be hitting Brooks almost off the apron there. Pulling him through big. Matt Baker with the Lycos. Kirby survives. Can he get the tag in to Tanazaki? We saw last night Tanazaki so effective when he can run at people, particularly with those knee strikes. CCK could be prone here now. Tanazaki is in the ring. Tanazaki now working on Lycos. Brooks comes in to make the save. Well, threw some fists there. Didn't have any opportunity to get that knee-based offense going that he's so well known for, but fighting back now. But avoid Brooks with a big forearm on, on Lycos. Oh! And counters a brain buster attempt from Brooks with a suplex of his own. CCK now making their way to the outside. What's that as I can go in for here? Hitting it like a oh, oh huge, yeah, huge dive over the top rope. And took out the front row and the second row to match. But he's back on his feet. You gotta wonder how much damage is done to Tanazaki there. Kate's community center getting a real up close view of Noiki Tanazaki. Brooks with a double underhook. But Tanazaki now catching him in the octopus stretch. A move very well known by Chris Brooks himself. 
but Lycos needs to come and break it up. Catching Lycos' bo boots now. What are they going for? Big Bandera's there from Kirby. Big kick to the head. Oh, and here we go. Oh, reversal by Lycos. Oh, there's a knee mark. There's knee, a knee mark. Knee the to face. The that's face. one. That's two. Unbelievable. Breaks it up. I believe he was going for the implant there. The, uh, you're right, the implant he calls that Mexican pile driver. That's what Tanazaki was looking for. Lycos reversed into a roll up, but took a knee to the face for his troubles. Brooks with the save, but now taking some punishment from Kirby. A wheelbarrow from Lycos. Oh! oh! The face must have mixed with a drop kick from Brooks. Break up from Tanazaki just about. As innovative as ever, RCCK. Now trading blows, Tanazaki and Chris Brooks. Tanazaki getting the better of him with some strong forearms here. Big pump kick from Brooks. Big super oh, kick from again. Kirby. Taking Brooks down. Oh, Lycos oh, the kick combo from Lycos. Oh, Huge knee from Tanazaki. Goes for the super oh, catches him with the knee. Brooks and all the men are Tanazaki. down. Tasting some of his own medicine there, Mark Andrews. And the crowd now showing their appreciation for all four men. Press Start shows so often known for their video game themed wackiness, but this one encounter which does not require any such thing. A pure tag team wrestling match and incredibly even right now, Mark. Both men trading blows back and forth here. Who's going to get the better? Big double knee, uh, knee to the gut there from CCK. The team of Kirby and Tanazaki. Big form from Tanazaki. Big backbreaker from Kirby. What's Tanazaki going for here? Up to the top rope. Oh, Big a knee. knee stomp. What a knee, and this is this one. Be it. This is two. Oh! oh, pushes Tanazaki Brooks. into the pin. Very clever it's from Brooks. Push Tanazaki. I don't know if that was intentional or not, but. It seemed to do the job, it broke up the pin. If it was intentional, then that was some seriously smart work by Brooks. Huge jumping knee there from Lycos into Kirby. And is he going to hit it here? Ah, uh, no. Sable bomb attempt. Is he going to hit it? Hits the Sable bomb. Oh, Nelson. Rolls him back. Big running spear in the corner. From Lycos. How are they going for it? He's got him up. Sick effing tag move. Back set up from Brooks. This could be it. One, One two. two. Oh, Tanazaki breaks it up. Just in the nick of time. It's been a long time since we've seen that sick effing tag move from Lycos and Brooks. As Lycos referenced earlier, seven months he has been out of action. Nearly picking up the win on his day, on his return, I should say, there. Tanazaki, though, keen to keep his momentum going that he's built in his early showings here in the United Kingdom. It's two on one now with CCK and Tanazaki left in the ring. Big oh, close, Tanazaki line. overcoming the odds here. A running train on them both, I believe. Oh! Moved all the way by Chris there, gets the boot up though. And he hits it! Kid Lycos with a full moon. Shoop! Oh no! Big cutter! But he hits Lycos! Brooks going for that slingshot cutter. Tennis Aki must have pulled him in the way there. Big knee! What's he going for? Here's the implant! The implant no! He hits it on Brooks! One, two, three! Tanazaki and Kirby with the victory.